Well, welcome back to A Helping Hand. Dave Oni here along with my friend Jennifer. Hello. Here we are. We've moved inside this week. We are. Even though it's a gorgeous It's gorgeous day outside, out there today. Summer, I think, has finally kicked in. And, I hope and, so. Uh, we're enjoying that. Yes, we are. So, so, so what's new? Well, the store has been really busy, which is awesome. We're coming off the 4th of July week, and it was crazy in here all week, which mm -hmm. was awesome. Okay. Um, but we still have lots of donations pouring in as well, um, lots of furniture stuff coming in. Uh, we're getting ready, I think I mentioned last week, to um, reorganize a little bit to expand our liquidation section because we're trying to get, it's been such a hit here that we're trying to get as much as we can out on the floor and then also um, anticipating this, this next truck that we're, we haven't figured out when we're going to order it, but that'll be here fairly so. soon yeah Let, let's take a, a few minutes here and just uh, uh, issue a special welcome to our summer visitors whether yes they're, absolutely they're here for a weekend or a week or for the summer if they're at their cabin stop in and see what the helping hand thrift store has for you there's I mean you know a fully stocked thrift store well, here and you know with Honest, I was going to say with this past week, with it being the fourth, and a lot of people being here from out of town or out of state or whatever, you know, a lot of people coming in and they forgot their coffee maker or, you know, who knows oh, yes. what coffee maker or swimsuit or towels or things like that. But it's fun for me when I'm up at the register to be able to visit with the customers a little bit to find out where they're from. And, mm -hmm. you know, visiting, I'm from the Brainerd Lakes area, but I grew up in the Twin Cities and I lived in California and I lived in Washington. But to sit and to find out like where some people are, are coming from and it's kind of neat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's especially fun to just chat with those people uh -huh. and find out a little bit about about their history yeah. and then share a little bit about the Port Lakes. Yeah, and well there was actually a gentleman that was here from Texas and he um, they, they didn't have a thrift store, but he had a ministry out there, kind of like the, the refuge. Oh, really? Yeah, and he was so excited to because he didn't know what we were about until he asked, and I explained about the refuge and the Compassion House and, you know, where our profits and proceeds go to. And he got he was really excited and okay. um, excited to come back here, too, and took the information and stuff like that. So it was pretty cool. Okay, good. So um delivery and uh, or not delivery but pickup services available pickup services and we do actually do some delivering as well oh, really? um, within a 10 mile radius of detroit lakes we can deliver there is a delivery charge which um you know depending upon what the item is or where we might be going but that is mm -hmm. something that you can ask about here at the store oh we're not, I, I didn't know that we're, well we're not we haven't done a lot of advertising for it just because we haven't done it a lot but this summer with you know people coming and um wanting to get a couch but they have no way to get it to their cabin or what have you, mm -hmm. where we, it, just ask about it. Okay. I, I can't guarantee we would always be able to do it, but it's something that, that we're open to, so. Okay. Now, something before we went on camera here, you had mentioned that you have a, a number of wheelchairs yes. that come in. Actually, today, today um, we had somebody drop off. I think there's probably a good 15 wheelchairs back really? there and then some walkers and, and things like oh. that. So, and it's okay. funny because I had, over the last week, I had two people coming in asking for wheelchairs. And we have, we have one here for store use for somebody sure, who sure. comes in who might have a broken foot or can't walk or what have you. Um, but now we have quite a few for sale. <laughs> but, you know, and what a handy thing. I mean, they, they can be fairly spendy. Oh, yes. Yeah. You know, but but if, if they're able to pick one up, you know, at a place like here mm -hmm. and uh, have it around for a, a second. Just in case yeah, scenario. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or if you've got somebody coming to visit yep. and things. So uh, are they on the floor yet? Yep, or, they'll be oh, on the floor. Okay, yep. Okay. So, so yeah, what a, a neat thing. Yeah, so, pretty cool. Uh, let's just put a plug in for Old Fest. Hope Fest, um, August 21st, 22nd, 23rd. And I think that Mel will be coming on um, TV3 soon to maybe talk a little bit about that. And if you have any questions or want to order tickets, you can call here the thrift store, 844-2240, or the refuge, 847-1982. Okay, and that, that's, that's a very special event. This is the third annual. Third event, annual, yeah. yep. So with uh, motivational speakers, outstanding music. Yep. Uh, wonderful food, food, awesome food, and and uh, hopefully lots of sunshine. Yes, I hope so. <laughs> for, for the most part, the event has been pretty uh, fortunate. Pretty with, fortunate. There was the weather. first one. I think there was the the hint of thunderstorm, um, but it, it ended up being okay. So okay, okay. and that, that takes care uh, takes place up on your grounds. Yep. Just to the north side, not far uh, off Richwood Road, Richwood Road and Tower Road. Yep. So refuge programming continues over on A Street, the solid grounds. 
coffee shop is yep. open daily? Yep, daily. Uh, yeah. Sundays, closed on Saturdays sure, and Sundays. Sure. Yep. Okay, okay. But uh, the thrift store here downtown open uh, Monday through Friday at 9.30. Yep. And open Saturdays at 10. 10, yep. So right downtown Detroit Lakes, if you've not been here, make a point of stopping in. Uh, as always, you look forward uh, to donations and things. Absolutely. And uh, helping the whole, whole community. Yep. So good to have you join us once again. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching, and, and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you again next week.